You may be a freelancer, an employee, or a business owner, but you might be curious what to do first in ClickUp. My name is Shirley from the ClickDown channel, and I'll be here to walk you through on how I actually start my day in ClickUp, and so I know exactly what to do and when to do it. So if you have a cup of coffee, let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing that I go to is actually not the whole screen, but I go first to my notifications. Why? Because in notifications, that's where I can immediately see activities from yesterday or in the past few days that I need to be on top of. And so I see here all of these tasks. If you only want to see tasks that are assigned to you, just click on assign to me. And if you want to see tasks that mention you, then you can go ahead and click the add mentions and clear that. So when you go back to your new, make sure that you are seeing this quote from ClickUp and that means that you have zero notifications. So what's the second thing that I check in ClickUp? So I have here an everything space and I actually check for high priority or urgent tasks. So to do that, you can go ahead and create a view. So I'll click on plus view and add a list view. And I will rename this list as high priority. So what I need to see here is to add a filter where the priority is version and high. And so I would like to be updated if there are any high priority or urgent tasks so that I can address them right away. So that's the second thing that I can check on my day. Now, once those are done, that's when I go to the home screen. So in the home screen, I'll be able to see all my tasks due today, overdue and next. I'll also see if there are any unresolved comments here or anything that's already done or delegated. Under to do, I'd see here all of my tasks for today. And what I need to do is to enable my calendar view. You can also choose to have a agenda view if you prefer it this way. But for the purposes of checking when my availability is for today, I would open my calendar view. And so I would go ahead and put in tasks from my today's task here to the right to my calendar. So let's say that I will be putting in my weekly CEO day here as an open slot and put in some of my other tasks here and fill them in. As long as I see an open slot, then I'll put in my task into my calendar. So I also see an overdue task and I can go ahead and put that into my calendar for today as well. So take note that what happens if you put an overdue task in today's calendar is that it actually changes the due date to today and the time is also updated. So you can see here that all my tasks for today now has an updated time of when I will be doing it. So that's the beauty of ClickUp is that you know that this is the time that you have to actually do this task and you can integrate it with your calendar. So it also shows on your calendar. So I go through the rest of the day and eat lunch, do whatever. So what else do I do? I'll go ahead and maybe check emails, answer to anything that needs to be replied to. And at the end of the day, I still go through my notifications bar, make sure that I don't have any more notifications and just check them off. And I'll be checking my calendar for tomorrow and see what will be my activity for tomorrow's calendar. So I'll be able to prepare whatever I need for that day. And I'll be just making sure that I'm on top of everything and that's it. How I start and end my day in ClickUp 
If that was helpful to you, then you can go ahead and watch our other videos about productivity or efficiency using ClickUp.